Well, good Monday morning to you. Faith Pocatello Daily here. It's the 2nd of January, 2023. And we're looking at this idea of purification and identity. So, uh, you know, the whole mark of, of purification and identification, as we looked at in the circumcision of Jesus yesterday, we're going to continue to look at, at what it means for us to be purified and also identified. Um, so let's look at that very closely here. No, no. 1 John 3, 1 through 3. See what kind of love the Father has given to us that we should be called children of God. And so we are. The reason why the world does not know us is that it did not know Him. Beloved, we are God's children now. And what we will be has not yet appeared, but we know that when He appears, we shall be like Him, because we shall see Him as He is. And everyone who thus hopes in Him purifies himself as He is pure. One of the identifying marks of the believer is what we hope for. Those things that we believe in, those things that, that cause our consciences to be purified. And so the pure hope that we have in Jesus Christ, and that as his appearing, we will be changed in the twinkling of an eye, and we will see him as he is, and yet we will be like him. What does that mean to be like him? It means we will be unstained by sin. These bodies of flesh will be removed, and the, the trueness of who we are as God's children now will be completely revealed, and we will be pure and spotless, blameless. And we can sit there and say, glory to God, because wretched people were we, but now you have done the work. You receive the glory and the honor and the praise. So I hope you hope in that. So may God richly bless your day. Enjoy Jesus. Go and share life.